left with a $75 fine. Indiana Senator Dan Coats is using a combination of humor and Twitter to battle sanctions placed against him by Russia. His Twitter account lists the top 10 things he won't be able to do since he was banned from the country. For example, Coates says he won't be able to compare Rusheville, Indiana, to Russia. He also says that his summer vacation in Siberia is a no-go. Coates authored a resolution calling for sanctions after Russia invaded Ukraine. I will suggest that we construct a complete, comprehensive plan to isolate Putin's Russia from the community of nations. The Indiana senator is one of nine people on a list calling for sanctions by the Kremlin. It is 641. Nobody's laughing at uh, the weather this morning, Ken. No, not at all. In fact, uh, we'd like to put sanctions on the cold temperatures here. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's not going to be working. Let's take a look at the temperatures outside from yesterday. Oh boy, I hope you had a chance to at least get out and enjoy a little bit of it yesterday. Upper 60s, lower 70s in some spots, even some mid-60s up towards north. We're tracking much colder temperatures for your weekend forecast. Still to come, Arsenal Tech has one giant step to reach their goal. We'll check in on the IPS Titans ahead of Semi-State later in the show. When you see it happen, report it. Send your news, pictures, and video to 24 Hour News 8. It's easy with the reported feature on our smartphone app or by emailing us at